Doxepin is a psychotropic agent used for the treatment of depression, anxiety, manic depressive disorder, and insomnia. In this video, let's find found. What is doxepin? What is doxepin used for? Contraindication. What are the side effects of taking doxepin? How does doxepin work? How to use doxepin? What is doxepin? Doxepin is a medication belonging to the tricyclic antidepressant class of drugs used to treat major depressive disorder, anxiety disorders, chronic hives, and insomnia. For hives, it is a less preferred alternative to antihistamines. It has a mild to moderate benefit for sleeping problems. Doxepin was approved for medical use in the United States in 1969. It is available as a generic medication. In 2020, it was the 252nd most commonly prescribed medication in the United States, with more than 1 million prescriptions. What is doxepin used for? Oral doxepin is approved for the following indications. Treatment of depression and or anxiety. Treatment of depression and or anxiety associated with different conditions, including alcoholism, organic disease, and manic depressive disorders. Treatment of psychopressive disorders with associated anxiety. Treatment of involutional depression. Treatment of manic depressive disorder. Treatment of insomnia characterized by difficulties with sleep maintenance. Topical doxepin is also approved for short-term, up to eight days, management of moderate pruritus in adult patients with topic dermatitis, pruritus or lichen simplex chronicus. Off-label, doxepin is used topically for the management of neuropathic pain. Contraindication Known contraindications include hypersensitivities to doxepin, other TCAs, or any of the excipients inside the product used. Glaucoma. A predisposition to developing urinary retention, such as in benign prostatic hyperplasia. Use of monoamine oxidase inhibitors in last 14 days. Side effects. Central nervous system, fatigue, dizziness, drowsiness, lightheadedness, confusion, nightmares, agitation, increased anxiety, difficulty sleeping, seizures, infrequently, temporary confusion, delirium, rarely induction of hypomania, and schizophrenia, stop medication at least, extrapyramidal side effects, rarely, abuse in patients with polytoxicomania, rarely, ringing in the ears, tinnitus, anticholinergic, dry mouth, constipation, even ileus, rarely, difficulties in urinating, sweating, precipitation of glaucoma, antiadrenergic, low blood pressure. If patient arises too fast from the lying slash sitting position to standing, known as orthostatic hypotension, abnormal heart rhythms, e.g., sinus tachycardia, bradycardia, and atrioventricular block. Allergic slash toxic, skin rash, photosensitivity, liver damage of the cholestatic type, hepatitis, extremely rare, leuco or thrombocytopenia, rarely, agranulocytosis, very rarely, hypoplastic anemia, rarely. Others, frequently increased appetite and weight gain, rarely nausea, rarely high blood pressure. May increase or decrease liver enzyme levels in the blood of some people. Pharmacodynamic. Similar to other tricyclic antidepressants, doxepin was shown, in preclinical trials, to decrease the electrical activity of the brain, prolong the hexabarbital-induced sleep and block avoidance behavior without affecting the conditioned emotional response. At high doses, it also produces symptom central nervous system depression. Doxepin is known to cause antidepressant, sedative, and anticholinergic effects. At high doses, its anticholinergic and antiadrenergic properties are the most prevalent, which limit its efficacy. These effects are observed at high doses, where its affinity for the H1 histamine mirror is lost and its binding to other receptors is observed. The maximal antidepressive effects of doxepin are present around two weeks following initiation of therapy. However, the sedative effects of doxepin, usually used for the treatment of insomnia or anxiety, are observed immediately after administration. Mechanism of action. The exact mechanism of doxepin's action is not very clear. However, doxepin is known to be a selective histamine H1 receptor blocker. 
This effect on histamine receptors indicates effectiveness in skin conditions. Breaking its function according to the different effects, doxepin's antidepressant action is primarily associated with the inhibition of the central nervous system biogenic amine reuptake, more specifically, norepinephrine and serotonin at synaptic nerve terminals. This effect increases the level of monoamines in the synaptic site, which in order increases the activity at the postsynaptic neuron recites. It has been suggested that doxepin also desensitizes both serotonin 1A receptors and beta-adrenergic receptors. It is known that the lack of dopamine transporters in the frontal cortex and the transmission of dopamine in this region is largely inactivated by the effect of norepinephrine reuptake. Hence, doxepin action on the frontal cortex is suggested to increase dopamine neurotransmission in this area. Half-life the mean elimination half-life is reported to be 15 hours. Dose. Depression slash anxiety. Initiate at low dose, 25 mg per day, gradually titrate upward every 5 to 7 days. Dosage range, 25 to 300 mg slash day PO, up to 150 mg per day, a single dose. If dose exceeds 150 mg per day, Divide Q12HR. Dosing considerations. May give QHS to decrease daytime sedation. Insomnia, silenia. Sleep maintenance. 3 to 6 mg PO within 30 minutes before bedtime, not to exceed 6 mg per day. Hepatic impairment slash debilitated patients, 3 mg PO within 30 minutes before bedtime. Safety advice. Oral doxepin is classified as a pregnancy category C drug. Topical doxepin is classified as pregnancy category B. Both forms of doxepin are contraindicated during breastfeeding. That's all the information about doxepin we collected. Thanks for listening. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe for the He Info channel if you like this video to update more health information.